I think I hit my limit. Why ask to be friends if you're going to do this? I lit 50 of their torches. They lit zero of my torches. I could not think of a sadder two-sentence story. You know, I'm, I'm pretty much the worst person in the world for that because you guys light my torches all the time and I don't think I've ever lit any of your torches. Sorry. I'm not sorry. Hey guys, welcome back to another My Singing Monsters video. Today, we're gonna take a look at some more memes. It's been a while and there's always fresh content coming from the subreddit. In fact, the subreddit is a top 2% subreddit by size. Also guys, there's a cat screaming at my door. My screaming cat. Someone go get it, okay? What you doing? Oh my God, so many noises coming from this cat who voluntarily ran into my room, by the way. I was not bothering her, she was bothering me. Now I'm gonna bother you to smash the like button. By the way guys, while I'm here petting this cat, I also wanted to ask you if you got any great ideas for MSM videos, okay? Because I don't got a lot of content I can make on this game. I know there's Dawn of Fire and I will go back, but if you have any great ideas for videos, let me know down below in the comments while you're smashing the like button. Thank you. Say thank you. <laughs> thank you. Requires. So this is some sort of bug that's going on in the game right now. I guess it's on like the new map screen. It says, listen up, requires. The uh, comments are having a bit of a field day with this one, guys. We got uh, this uh, very interesting thing happening here. This one as well. Yeah, it's a, it's a good time over here. How to make Five Nights at Freddy's 10 times scarier. Put the exert in it. God, that is such an ugly monster, man. And I mean, he doesn't even make any good noises. He just like makes burp noises, you know what I mean? Forget about Freddy Fazbear, nobody cares, bro. This video made me realize that Exert looks like a Garden of Ban Ban character. Its entire body is one color, it has a weird lumpy texture, it looks vaguely scary, but also ridiculous, and has a bunch of weirdly placed body parts. Yeah, you're pretty right. Not trying to offend, but I think a good way to avoid jokes being made in the Fan Theories channel is to make an insanity channel as a meme slash joke slash sarcastic counterpart to the Fan Theories channel. We will not be making an insanity channel. Damn, Monster Handler Jen just laying down the, the facts here, guys. I don't know, I kind of feel like that would be kind of cool. Maybe you want to choose a different name. Maybe insanity has some connotations. Maybe it, it might go a little overboard if you call it that. Maybe call it conspiracies, conspiracy theories. That'd be fun so people can throw out all their weird suggestions or whatever, weird thoughts. I don't know. My problem with an all ethereals island. If Workshop is inside Ethereal Island, then this is the relative size of the Workshop, which means that a gas is this big, and then the relative size of uh, 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 whatever that one's called is really small. I don't know, man. I mean, we got this thing called Bigify in My Singing Monster, so I don't really feel like size matters all that much. I feel like I've wasted so many keys. How it feels trying to get epics on Amber Island. I actually don't relate to this like at all. Not even the tiniest amount. If you did the same post and it was someone throwing a whole lot of relics in the toilet, I would understand. But I've been begging the monster handlers to take away my keys. I have so many keys because of you guys. What am I gonna do, bite dipsters with them? I've already done it and trust me, I regretted it immensely. I'm not here to complain. I'm not here to say that my singing monsters is an unfair game or something but I am seeing a lot of people basically say that Amber Island is a complete joke and that they won't even go there anymore. So I feel like a little bit vindicated because that's the way I feel. I'm like Amber Island, uh, I had a bad time yesterday. I think today I wanna have a good time. Yesterday I ran uh, a 10 mile race. Okay, I did it in 80 minutes and 20 seconds, something like that. I'm proud of myself, but my body really hurts now. Freaky train caught in the act. This one's actually considered not safe for work content, guys. It's just a screenshot for my scene monsters, so I don't see how I can't show you. Everybody's having a good time. That's all we need to say. Okay, maybe not everyone is having a good time. It looks like Flawa might actually be a little bothered by the situation. <laughs> I wonder why. I arrived, guest. I left work early and mm, I can't explain. What, what is he doing? He's holding something. What is he holding over here? Floris and Rorik are best friends. They both have ADHD. Do they? <laughs> okay, cool, I relate. And this is just a picture of Floris 
chilling out. Actually, it's a pretty cool little picture, not gonna lie. Nice job. Tear list my mom made. Not my mom, I'm just reading the title of the post. Sugarbush Island is her favorite. Mythical Island is actually amazing. You know, like the Yoli Yoli in there is just perfect. Uh, Composer Island, hey, Composer Island's pretty good too, okay? Mom, mom, mom knows best here, guys. I don't want to go through each of these. I want to see what she considers the worst. Okay, Celestial, sure. Is that Cave Island from Dawn of Fire? Probably. And Seasonal Shanty. Uh, I've never been to Cave Island. I don't know what it's like, but uh, yeah. I mean, the other two aren't super great. She doesn't like Gold Island. And what's the deal with her not liking cold? What the heck is wrong with mom, bro? It's got a friggin' stromboning on it, dude. Seriously? You're gonna put it all the way down there when it's got a stromboning? Perhaps. The mom rated these based on how annoying they are to hear when her son plays the game. Son or daughter, I don't know who made this post. You know what I mean. Because I, I don't know, maybe the mom plays, maybe she doesn't. That's all I'm saying. Anyone else notice this eye-looking shape in the middle of the mirror map? You mean the, the eye? You mean the thing that's clearly an eye? No, I didn't actually notice it, but yeah, I just think it's funny that they called it an eye-looking shape. Hmm. Yeah, I've got a couple eye-looking shapes in my eye sockets. They're called eyes. There's a thrumble in a wooden toilet. There's a guy who looks like he came out of like Hustle Castle or something. He's wearing a monster handler. Uh, shirt, which is cool. Let's see what kind of trouble he gets into. He's opening a mammoth. Good idea. Here it comes. Oh my god. Nine, 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 nine. Is that his level? Did that guy just get his jaw broken? Did he just get kicked? Did he just end up in friggin' plants versus zombies? What is going on, monster handlers? You know what's happening here, obviously. The flower is a sunflower, you know what I mean? The, uh, the pot belly is a pea shooter. And the most zombie looking creature in the game is the zombie. You know, the, uh, the night bear. We all feel so bad for him because of how disgusting he is. And I guess he's gonna get revenge for all the bad things we said to him. Let's go. They're not even, oh, they are. I was gonna say, they're not, I'm not seeing any contact. You know, like, you see how these peas fly across the screen, but they don't actually hit anything? What a bad commercial this is, am I right, guys? God, really breaking my immersion here. I thought this was actually Plants vs. Zombies. A monster Plants vs. Monster Zombies, or something. This guy has some sort of, like, special attack as well, which is great. Maybe PVZ needs that. Who got you, God? Dude, you make, you make sun. What are you doing? Oh, my God. Not indicative of actual gameplay. Really? You sure about that? They have to say that now, I'm pretty sure, because of how bad the uh, the ads got and people were actually being misled. I don't think anyone's gonna watch this and think that's actually what the game is, but kind of amazing that they made PVZ with MSM. You know what I mean? Those are like two of my most popular series, guys. This is the crossover we all needed, honestly. Here's, that's indicative of real gameplay, guys. Should the Magicals be in Dawn of Fire? Honestly, if they're gonna look like this, absolutely. I love this. It's a it's a baby uh, banjo, right? I love that they gave that thing braces. I love that it fits the style absolutely perfectly. I don't know how people do such a great job on like fan art, man. Like I love it when the fan art looks like it's from the game. This person made a whole bunch of these guys, so we gotta look through some of them, okay? This is the hollow as a baby. Uh, that is a baby gloptic. I like it. Hey, I like this guy. He's really cute. Oh my god. Okay, this might be my favorite so far. They are adorable. Bro, Bridget. Bridget. Some of them are like really high quality and some of them aren't. It's all good. Love that. Love that. Love that. Love that. <laughs> I love them all, okay. How many are there? Let's just get, get to the end. It, We found it, there we go. Now, somebody said, guys, that uh, according to the lore, it would be impossible for magical monsters to be in Dawn of Fire. I guess they weren't created yet or something. Uh, that's sad, but that's life. People have been saying that Rismith looks like Minecraft, so they put Rismith in Minecraft. I mean, it's super blocky. It's like a voxel character. So yeah, of course, of course it kind of looks like it's from Minecraft. Speaking of Minecraft, guys, you gotta check this out. Look what somebody made 
for Minecraft. I, they, they say they're gonna make a full mod and add more. I hope they do, because I would love to be able to have little creatures like this, like follow me around in Minecraft. I've always wanted like a really well-made Minecraft MSM mod where you can just recruit monsters and they'll run around singing a song for you as you play the game. Like that would be so cool. And I think they did a really good job on this one. Look at that. That's, that's super, super awesome. I want it, make it now. Here to remind everyone, this is a photo posted by the official MSM TikTok account. Damn, bro, that thing can jump. I mean, it doesn't have any legs, but that ain't stopping them. Okay, big debate. All right, guys, big debate. Who is the icon of my singing monsters? Is it the mammoth or is it the fur corn? Oh my God, this is so difficult. Okay, I've, I've decided I'm gonna go with fur corn just because I think I like fur corn a little bit more than mammoth. I, it's hard to pick because they're just, they're both very iconic, but I'm gonna say fur corn would be my pick if I had to pick someone to be the icon because sometimes it's mammoth, sometimes it's fur corn, sometimes it's something else, you know what I mean? So there. That's my decision, little puffy eye boy. Imagine a Highlands Island. That would be so sick. Scotland Epic Wabox. It's in the boss fight subreddit. I wouldn't want to fight this guy. He looks pretty, pretty crazy, man. I got a lot of respect for anyone who can be a one-man band. You know, it's a full-body workout, dude. Is he like beatboxing as well? Dude. Wait, so is he powering the thing with his feet? I think he might be powering the bagpipes thing with his feet. Yeah, he's he's doing a little bit of a like a dubstep beatbox thing. Amazing. I wonder how long this guy actually goes for. I wonder how many days or hours a day he spends just doing this. Pretty cool, not gonna lie. This is from the official Mon Singing Monsters Discord. What is going on here, man? Why is, why is Gnarls just prying open Gob's face, dude? Nah, it's normal, that's cool. Probably checking for tonsillitis. I think I hit my limit. Why ask to be friends if you're going to do this? I lit 50 of their torches. They lit zero of my torches. I could not think of a sadder two sentence story. You know, I'm I'm pretty much the worst person in the world for that because you guys light my torches all the time and I don't think I've ever lit any of your torches. <laughs> sorry. I'm not sorry. Here's some fan art. Beds required, 20. Um, I didn't realize at first, but it's the Pentumbra in the corner and then like all the rest of the beds are taken up by the shadow. And then I was like, Wait, 20 beds? Really, is that how many beds Pentumbra takes up? Surprisingly, yeah, that actually is how many beds it takes up. 20 beds required. That's a lot of beds. Like, how sleepy are you? Um, this is Pom Pom on Tinder by the look of it. I like how they actually have like their own like weird looking like top bar. Ula. Wisp. Okay. Hey, you got a match! Very cool! Oh my god, wait a minute. Oh no. Oh no, they're gonna... Well, I guess that was that was pretty tame, to be honest. Although I don't think you're supposed to just disappear. Oh no. Womp 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 womp. How I feel when I breathe that monster, am I right? Well, here is actually an ad. It's not like a, an ad outside of MSM. It's in MSM, but it says, tired of ads, you can buy any currency pack to remove third-party ads in your game forever. And then they did the, you know, the that meme, you know, the Drake meme. I mean, nothing wrong with this. It's a pretty good use of the meme, isn't it? I don't know if this one is an ad or what. The post is just titled, MSM is for kids. Hmm. Fatality. I love the auto captions here. Victory. Flawless victory. It's okay. They just died a little bit. Okay, I got a problem, guys. Okay, this ad here says the MSM Kid is back. I need to find the original MSM Kid video, okay? It's very important. My Singing Monsters Dare to Sing a Song. Epic and Brat Advertisement 2024. Bruh. 
That's sketchy. No, you can't hurt Epic Ed Brat. Bruh. Bruh, he's in the Coliseum. He's giving him a tummy ache. This is ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous, and I kind of love it. <laughs> Would you dare to sing a song? Holy crap, did he win? It doesn't say. But he I he was he was hurt. He was losing health. And then MSM kid got burped on. I don't know. I think he might have died. I think I think that that guy just freaking died, man. Every cursed MSM ad in existence in one video. Okay, we already saw the first one, so let's skip ahead to the next one. All right, things are things are gonna be all right. Would you dare sing a song? Okay, this is the Tower of uh, uh, I forget what it's called. You know the game. It's a very common ad, very common game format. They always make a mistake. See, they made a mistake, and then they died. Wow, MSM Kid has a bad time all the- Oh my god, that- Well, you probably wouldn't have killed Gnarls anyway, to be honest. Okay. Breed them, feed them, listen to them sing. This is 2018, I guess they're gonna do like the parent versions or something. Wait, what? Excuse me? Did you just- That not- It's not a thing, what are you doing? What is this? Stop it! Stop it! It's not an island! It's not a thing! You can't even use a breeder on on Celestial Island! What the heck is happening? And then there's the Tinder one. Okay. Those are the weird MSM ads. Great. Well, I needed to see the other MSM Kid one. Okay. MSM Kid, I can't wait to see you come back again, dude. I can't wait to see what you get up to. Alright? I want a whole, like, Lily's Garden story arc for MSM Kid. Who's with me? Smash the like button if you're with me. All right, guys, that's where I'm going to end this episode of My Singing Monsters Memes. I hope you enjoyed. I know I did, okay? That was, the, that was an absolute roller coaster. I didn't even know about this MSM kid until now. Yeah, definitely the highlight of my day. So, uh, so that's something. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please hit the like button. And you can click right here to watch another one of my videos.